Hey, Ruben, if I could, uh, if I could interrupt you for a second. I know you're looking pretty, pretty busy here. Um, yeah, question. Um, do you think you're pretty good at challenges? All right, let me rephrase the question and get the snot off the lens. Okay, buddy, let me try to rephrase the question here. I know you're good at challenges. You know, we all have difficulties with some versus others, but what we'd like to do is have you try a challenge that involves you finding traits. That's right. So we're gonna set this up. We're gonna see how quickly you can find said treats, which happen to be strategically placed. No, they're not out there. I haven't set it up yet, but I, I like your moxie. I like your gumption, trying to find it. Find where they are, get at it. All right, well, let me get it set up. We'll see how quickly you can do it and if you can discover all the treats. Okay, it's only fair if we condition him to show you what he's gonna, what do you, <laughs> to show him what he's gonna be doing. So we're gonna take a treat and we're gonna cover it with a cup. See? That's how this is gonna work, Ruben. That is how this is gonna work. So here we go, another treat, there's the cup. knocked over. You get the idea. You get the idea. So, Ruben, there's just one cup right there. We're going to do more. All right, again, I like your determination. That's good. Bulldog determination is a good thing. We're going to have more than one cup, buddy. In fact, we're going to have a lot of cups. So, you're going to have a lot of work and to, uh, a lot of searching to do. Let's see if you can get them all, okay? So we have retreated to the uh, the safety of the lab and we are gonna get things set up. As you can see, the dog is sequestered outside with the boy barking because he knows something's going on because he knows he's gonna be challenged. So here are said cups. Uh, Carol, I'm gonna guess it's gonna take him, we'll say five minutes max to knock over all these cups. It's gonna be probably about eh, 50, 50 cups. Five of them will have treats. We will mark them as such when we lay them out. So Carol, you think you can do it? And less than that? Absolutely. Okay, Carol's saying <laughs> probably three is a good uh, over under. So uh, uh -uh. he's going to bulldog. Under his, one. All right, because <laughs> you know because what's going to happen? His body is going to swing around and knock <laughs> everything right. over. So we shall see. So play the game at home. Uh, how quickly can the dog actually find five treats under fifty cups, roughly fifty cups, and we will mark them with a little X so we can see which is which as we're following along with the action here in the lab. So. We'll go ahead and I'll start getting set up. And away we go. Let's let our subject in.
Where's the treats? <clears throat> Ruben. <laughs> Epic fail. Ruben. Where's the treats? Where are they? Where's the treats? Wow. Ruben. <laughs> This is going horribly. Rue, what do you think? Come here. We have to give him a heads up. What's that? Uh. Hey. <laughs> it's right here. Ruben. Hey, come here. Ruben, come here. Look. Hey. Heart. This is too hard for him. Where's the treats? <clears throat> Look, buddy. It's right in front of you. Where are you going? Roof. Treats. Over here. I Experiment. Know, I know what happened. He's full? He's full because Michael fed him twice last night. I didn't mean to. It was an accident. It's maybe throwing off the... Uh, some of, the, some of this experiment. <laughs> All right, Rue. Let's let's lead you again. Come here. Wah, wah, How about this wah. one? <laughs> All right, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. You failed, Ruben. This is not his day. Maybe, you know what? Maybe he just didn't feel like doing the challenge because it was a little too beneath him. Maybe that was it. Aww. All right. I think well, he's too excited. He spent time outside barking, waiting for you. All right. Well, Ruben, would you? And he's getting some water. Okay. The experiment has officially ended. This challenge is over. The dog has failed. And uh, yes, he's still the most intelligent dog we've had, but this is not representative of his intelligence and his, uh, his curiosity. Look, Ruben, oh, you knocked it over. <laughs> See, he's got it. <sighs> All right, buddy. Well, the more you know. To follow Ruben, don't forget to click on the red subscribe button. Then click on the bell to be notified the next time a video comes out. Thanks so much.